Hello my little wolfies, Captain Tiger Lily here, and we are back with more Pokemon Uranium. Now in the last episode I said we were going to go tackle this gym, and that's exactly what we're going to do. Hopefully everybody is high enough level to be able to take on this gym, so if that isn't the case, we are going to go through to my team, and I'm going to give Mr. Krabs' um, EXP share to Ka. Because, gosh darn it, we need... Wait, the XP share would be in this one, wouldn't it? Duh. I'm stupid. Don't, don't... Don't say nothing. Okay, so I don't know what kind of gym this is going to be. But we're about to find out. You see my dad at the Ranger HQ. Oh, we have another thing to do first. Okay, where was the Ranger HQ? It was this, right? This is just somebody's house? Hmm. I don't know. Where was the Ranger HQ? We gotta go talk to our dad. Uh, I don't think it's there. Ah, West Tandor's Pokemon Ranger HQ. Cool. Hey, Dad. Hey, aren't you? Whoa, you're Tiger Lily, right? The Chief's kid. Quick, someone get Kellen. Can I walk? Nope. Tiger Lily? What are you doing here in Beale Beach? I see you have Pokeballs and a Pokedex. That's right, you're doing research for Professor Bamboo. You're a Pokemon trainer now. And everything. Tiger Lily. I'm at a loss for words. It's been so long since I last saw you. I should have expected your arrival. After all, there's a Pokemon gym here. Makes sense that you would come to Beale Beach. Still, I always wanted to give you a special tour of the Ranger HQ the biggest ranger station in all of West Tandor. And as you know, I'm the chief. It's a job with a lot of responsibility. So you will understand, I've been busy. Too busy to visit you in Moki Town. Yeah, about that. My goodness, you've grown so much, Tiger Lily. Traveling the region on your own. Of course I was the same when I was your age. I was a junior cadet in the uh, Elmia region, I think. That's how you say it? Say, how's that boy Theo? You and he left Moki Town together, if I recall correctly. I see he's still following in your footsteps. You may have the makings of a good leader in you. Just like your old man. Sorry to interrupt, Chief, but there's a letter for you. A letter? Hmm. It's from Cameron at the nuclear power plant. It says that construction will is proceeding as usual. Soon the new plant will be fully operational. He certainly works fast, I'll grant him that. Still, a new power plant. So soon after the old one was destroyed. Tiger Lily, I know that this is sudden, but I have a favor to ask of you. I need you to go to power plant Epsilon and deliver my response to Cameron. It's important to proceed with caution. Lucille, your mother, disappeared on that very island ten years back. It's important that we never forget that. Here, Tiger Lily, please take this. Thanks, Dad. I will send word to the power plant and tell them to expect you. I think Cameron will be happy to see you, too. I would come along, too, but I have to stay here and train the new ranger cadets. But I'm certain you can handle it yourself. You are my child, after all. Until next time, Tiger Lily. Um, about that. Not really a whole lot down here, and I don't feel like exploring it yet, because I feel like we might have to do that later. So, let's check out this map. Because apparently that's our mission first. 
Nuclear power plant Epsilon. So that's where we're supposed to go to. So... How do we do that? Maybe I can battle the gym now? You deliver Kellen's letter, of course. So... Maybe up here. There was a guy at the edge of the water who looked like a sailor. Dude. Oh, you're a trainer. Ugh, standing on solid ground makes me land sick. That's actually a thing. Because when I was on my cruise, Perry would like to battle and you have a pahar. Whoa! High level. My goodness. Glad I have lightning up front. So... When I was on my cruise and we stopped off at a couple of the locations, after being on the ship rocking back and forth all day, it was weird to actually be on solid ground and it actually kind of felt weird. Like, really weird. Yeah, that's not gonna do... Whoa, that was more than it, than it should have done. Okay, that's not cool. Bye, Pahar. Hubjaw? No. What the heck are you? You look like a very angry shark. Or a piranha. Whoa, I did not like how much that was. Okay, we are gonna use a potion before you get knocked out because I'm trying to be smarter about this even though I've done stupid things. Okay, fully restored. You're gonna bite again, and then we are going to... Why is it so much? Why is it so much? No, I still need spark. My gosh, I don't get it. It's so much. Oh my gosh. Ice Fang? What the heck are you? Seriously, what are you? I do not understand. I do not know what you are. But I do not like you. Sam I am. <laughs> oh my gosh. That didn't do anything. Maybe it's those guys out on the... Um, what do you call it? Out on the water, about halfway down the region. So, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center real quick and heal up Lightning. And then we're gonna attempt to figure out where we're supposed to go from here. Okay. Let's move, let's move, let's move. I really like the music for Beale Beach City. It's really good. Makes me happy. This ship. Ship will take you to the nuclear power plant construction site. Hey, wait a sec. Are you Tiger Lily? I got orders to take you to the power plant. But you're just a kid. What's Chief Kellen thinking? Hey, wait a sec. Great, it's Theo. Tiger Lily, you're going to the power plant. I want to come too. Aw, oh, jeez, now there's two kids? I gotta radio the boss about this. Hello? I got a situation out here on Route 7. These two kids are asking to go to the power plant. One of them looks like the kid that the rangers told us about. The other one's got crazy red hair. Kind of looks like boss's hair, actually. You're serious? Alright. Boss says I should bring you both over. To know what he's thinking, but I got orders, so hop on, both of you. Wahoo! I'm gonna see my dad. Whoa. Is this where dad works? Saying a place for children. I don't know what the boss was thinking. 
Theo, Tiger Lily. Good. You both have arrived. Follow me, please. Dad, check it out. Me and Tiger Lily are bona fide trainers now. I got two badges and everything. I can see that. I'm very proud of you, Theo. Seems like I made the right decision the right choice to let you travel on your own. Well, you ain't seen nothing yet. Just wait. I'm gonna become the best trainer ever. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure you will. Now, Tiger Lily, Kellen tells me you have something for me. Hmm. I see, I see. Not sure what his reasoning is, but I have to respect the chief's wishes. Tiger Lily, your father wants you to see the ruined power plant. As you know, there was an accident that occurred here ten years ago. The one where you lost your mother, Lucille. I must admit, Kellen has been fixated on it ever since. It's understandable. That event changed his life, as well as mine. I was there on that day, after all. I'd been called in to do some repairs. Everything was working perfectly when there was a sudden, unexpected malfunction. I tried to save as many workers as possible. The last time I saw Lucille, she was headed deeper inside. I called out to her, but she disappeared. They never found her. Ugh. Ouchy shoulder. I know this must be hard for you to hear. Perhaps seeing the plant will provide you with some much needed closure. But it's very dangerous. Although the radiation has cleared, there's something strange about the Pokemon here. You get to explore an abandoned power plant, Tiger Lily? That's so cool! I wanna come too! No, Theo. You are going back to the mainland. But, Dad, Tiger Lily gets to do it, so why can't I? As your father, I cannot allow you to go. It's far too dangerous. Kellen's wish is for Tiger Lily to go. I cannot disobey orders from the chief of the rangers. Besides, they have unfinished business there. I'm a trainer. I can handle wild Pokemon just fine. Not these ones. These are different. I won't have you anywhere near them. No fair. Life isn't always fair, Theo. Now I'll inform the boat captain to take you back to the mainland. As for you, Tiger Lily, you have my permission to look about the island. The ruined plant is to the south. You ought to be cautious, though. If you need to heal, there is a machine at the rest house. Some of the workers here are also Pokemon trainers. They might want to battle you. And above all, mind the wild Pokemon. They're... different. You'll see. I hope you can find what you came here for. I don't even know why he sent me in the first place, but okay, whatever. Fine. I need to readjust my chair. Ugh, okay. No hidden items up here. Okay, just checking. Ooh, berries. A halfly berry. I don't know what it does, but I'm gonna collect it. Is this the rest house thing? Yeah, this is the rest house. Whoa, this is way bigger on the inside. It's a TARDIS! I'm in a very much Doctor Who mood lately. I don't know why, I just have been. I guess because the new season isn't out yet and I really want to watch it, so it's probably part of it. So let's check out these wild Pokemon they're talking about. What do we got? Ooh. Whoa! It's a Tancoon, but... What are you? Are you, like, radioactive or something? Whoa! Do you think we should catch it? I kind of want to catch it. Don't faint, don't faint, don't faint. Damn it! Super effective. That's fine. What is that? Okay, if we see any nuclear radioactive Pokemon things, we're catching them. Let's battle a trainer. You probably heard by now that there's something odd about the Pokemon here on this island. They resemble ordinary Tandor species, but their colors are strange. Their attacks are different, and they don't listen to trainer commands. Could it have something to do with the accident ten years ago? 
Can we not catch them then? Maybe we can't catch them. Okay. Let's try to go a little easier on this Tancoon and see if we can catch it. I'm going to use... I'm going to use Water Gun as opposed to Spark this time. Oh, that still did it. Apparently Lightning's too high a level. That's fine, but I don't understand these Pokemon. Man, they are just all over. And it's all Tancoons for now. That's all we've seen. Maybe if I stomp. Maybe that maybe that'll not knock it out. I really want to try to catch one. Ooh, it's got a sliver. Gamma Ray? Whoa! Holy macaroni. Let, let's try it. One, two, three. Okay, we got a caught. No. I'm not going to name this one. But I'm going to go heal up real quick. Because I don't want Lightning to faint that quickly. Good lord. Particularly dangerous. So we had the healing machine brought to keep Pokemon's workers. Would you like to heal your Pokemon? Yes. Cool. Pokemon were healed. Stay safe and come back often to heal. Uh, that's my plan. Now there was a trainer down in that grass and we're going to fight him. We gonna fight him. Whoa. Okay, these nuclear Pokemon are freaking cool. I guess we'll just... Aqua Jet. I don't need to catch all of them as whatever these radioactive Pokemon are, but Gamma Ray. So maybe it's nuclear. Maybe maybe it is nuclear. Maybe it's not just plain old radiation. Maybe it's like, a, since it was a nuclear power plant, I guess they're nuclear affected Pokemon? I don't know. Hey, this island isn't a playground for kids. I'll have you know, I have two Pokemon badges. Super Scientist Cloud. Tufarang. Oh, you're going to play those games. Okay. I see how it is. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Mmm, yes. Ooh, Poison Fang. I don't like that. Let's get a water gun, or an aqua jet going in here. Oh, man. Lightning is not going to do well. We're going to switch. I'm going to switch to Phoenix. Because I don't... I don't want Lightning to faint. Again. And Tufering's a tough one. Weirdly enough. But it's fine. No! I hope we have a berry that can heal poison. I really do. Um... Air Cutter. Okay, I should be able to do one more Air Cutter. Hmm, maybe I want to do Incinerate. I know Fire's not going to be as effective in the rain, but I think that might be the better option. Not Incinerate, Flame Burst, duh. What am I talking about? I've lost my mind. It's fine. No, you were supposed to take him out. Come on, Phoenix. You can do better than that. 
Atta boy. No. Okay, Milan. I don't know what the next Pokemon is, but whatever. Minion! No, I want Minion so bad. Let's beat it up. <laughs> it's like so counterproductive. Beat up. Crit. I don't think this is very effective. It's not. Crap. I keep getting crits, though. I get that black belt. Five times. Okay, so let us rock smash, then. Stop using that damn poison fang. Okay. Bloodlust. It is a vampire bat. It's totally a vampire bat. Your defense fell. You're gonna poison fang again. That makes me not happy. Ha ha! Gotcha! Moxie? Okay, what do we got? Okay, good. You're no ordinary kid. Nope, I'm not. What you gonna do about it? Oops, not Pokemon. I poke a pot. I want the bag. That's what I want. Do I have I have an antidote. Use on Mulan. I'm sorry, Phoenix. I didn't want you to faint. I wish I had a max revive, but I can use a regular revive. On Phoenix, and I need some super potions. Definitely use one on Mulan, and definitely use one on Phoenix. Lightning is okay for now, although I don't necessarily like that that's the level it's at. Is there anything up here? Nope. Thought there might be an item, you never know. Okay, have you figured out what's up with the Pokemon here? They're nuclear! Super Scientist Isaac! Paradio. Paradio? Are you- I feel like you're psychic. You look psychic. You look very psychic type. Psybeam, yeah, you're psychic. I don't know if you're just straight psychic, but you are a psychic something. Oh, almost. Oh no, please don't faint, please don't faint, please don't faint, please don't faint. Whew. Okay, spark one more time, because we've got the speed, we're good. And I can heal you up after, and it'll be fine. Okay. Kostra. Yes, I'm switching. I'm switching to Ka. This is a dangerous thing to do. But I'm switching to Ka because of Bulldoze. Kostra is level 22. Okay. Do not faint, Ka. Do not faint. Hang in there for me, buddy. Come on. Okay, confusion. You can live that. Come on, one more bulldoze. There you go, there you go. That a boy! There we go. That's some good XP for you. Yes. Been stumped. Sorry, dude, but uh technically I should say sorry, not sorry. 
Ooh, there we go. Okay. Lightning is fine. Lightning is okay. Cause not getting a potion yet. What do we got? We got a Tancoon. Let's spark this sucker. Spark him out. Don't bite. We should have the speed on you. What? What the hell are your speed stats? My gosh. There you go. Add a boy lightning. Okay. There's another trainer. Okay. Hey, you, help me train my Pokemon. Calm down, dude. We'll get to it. Super scientist Albert would like to battle and sends out a Calmite. This I can do. Because we are a water type. That'll be good for us. It's going to be really good because this is a rock type. So, just Aqua Jet. What do we got? What do we got? It is a one hit KO. That is what I like to see. Yes, Lightning is 24. Paradio. Yeah, we'll stay in. We'll be fine. We'll spark it. It's fine. Ooh, you outspeed me. Intriguing. No! Oh no! Don't hit yourself in confusion! Okay, good. Good, good, good. Oh. I can risk one more. I think. Mm, don't hit yourself in confusion. Oh, thank you, Lightning. You are the best little water electric Pokemon ever. Okay. Can we get one more? Can we get one more? Can we be that lucky? Come on, Lightning. You got this. Come on. Don't faint. Don't faint. No! Son of a... Damn it. God damn it. I was hoping. I was so hopeful and... Ugh! So frustrating. Okay, Phoenix. Just peck. There you go. And it's a crit. Thank you for avenging our fallen friend. My Pokemon needs some more motivation. Well... Okay. Do I have another... I have one more revive. Alright, here we go. Alright, lightning. Got some nuclear Pokemons. Ooh, whoa, a nuclear Kostra. I kind of want to catch this because I don't have a regular cost draw. Okay, just stomp it. Please be gentle, lightning. Please be gentle. <gasps> what did you... You used Leer. That's fine. Now I can throw a Pokeball at you. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. One, two, three, yes! Not only did we catch a Kostra, we've got a nuclear Kostra. Sucker Pokemon, Poison Psychic. At this stage of development, Kostra's telekinetic powers are weak. It instead latches onto its foes and sucks out their life force. Whoa! Mm. What do we want to name you? Because you are from this region. So... Hmm. Uh, 
I'm gonna call you... I'm gonna call you Leech, because you suck the life out of other things, so... That's how you spell Leech, right? Sure, we'll go with it. Okay. There it is, the old power plant. I cannot tell you how many times I've searched this place, trying to find something, anything to explain what happened all those years ago. Of course it's no good. Almost everything was destroyed in the explosion. What wasn't destroyed was mostly burned up by the fire afterwards. The building is crumbling. It's slated for demolition soon. This may be the last chance we have to uncover what really happened. Although I doubt there's anything left to find. Are you going inside? Of course. It's the last place your mother was seen. But it is very dangerous. That's why... Here, I put a tracker on you. If something happens, if you get hurt, we'll come get you. That's a promise. Now I suggest you heal up and grab some supplies before going inside. You don't know what you might find in there. No items over here? Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the Pokemon Healy thingy. And then we're going to come back here. And I know this was a little shorter, but in the next episode we are going to tackle the power plant. Okay, guys? That's what we're going to do. So we're going to go back and heal up real quick. Apparently the first thing we're going to do is fight a Pokemon. Another Kostra. Okay. You're a lower level. She'll be able to take you out with a spark or two. I think. Oh, that was a one-hit KO. I like. Kyle grew to level 21. Good, good, good. Alright, alright. Alrighty, Lightning. Let's do this. Yeah, it's raining. We know. Here we go. I was gonna say, he's got six levels on the Kinect Monk. I think we're okay. Got another cost draw. Okay. So we can spark this one out. Uh, bye bye. Good, good, good. Another cross drop. So many of these nuclear Pokemons. But that's fine. I'm slowly building up. You know, our XP for Lightning and Ka at the moment, which is fine because I want them to be high levels, so. Ooh. That was nice. 78 for both of them. I already fought this dude. But I'm gonna go this way because there's other people over here that I want to talk to. Ooh. Outen. It looks like a weird freaky ghost thing with its eyes glowing like that. It looks really creepy and really cool at the same time. Just gonna say that. Okay, we're gonna spark. Ooh, you're gonna quick attack. I don't like that. Spark him out! Nicety nice! I likey, I likey. 
Okay. Cameron? Yeah, he's the boss around here. He's a nice guy. Everyone calls him Cam. Though he's kind of strange, you know. I've been working for him for months, but I still don't know a thing about him. Cam is the supervisor for construction on the new power plant. Apparently, he applied for it as soon as the area was deemed radiation free. It's kind of weird, isn't it? A little bit. It's hard to work here, knowing what happened on this island ten years ago. Feels like I'm walking in a graveyard sometimes. This new power plant has been built with the highest possible safety and security. After the accident ten years ago, the boss wanted to make sure that nothing like this happens ever again. <clears throat> can I get behind you? Like, can you walk out the way so that I can go? Oh man! Oh, I can wait here though. Then I can pass you. Cause I bet you anything, there's an item. Oh no, you won't let me. One more? No. Darn it. I wanna go in there. But it won't let me. Okay, let's talk to this guy. I have an itchy eye. Cam's our boss and he's a nice enough guy. He really likes Pokemon and he cares about his son, Theo. I can respect a man like that. Rumor has it Cam used to be a Pokemon trainer. Damn good one, too. They say he raised electric types. You should be careful with the wild Pokemon here. Take this, it should come in handy. Yeah, it probably will. It pays to come prepared. Yes, it does. Okay, we're gonna go in here. We're gonna heal up. Yep, 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 yep. I would like to heal Pokemon. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. He said there was a PC in here. Do you know how a nuclear reactor works? Power is generated by splitting atoms in the radioactive fuel, which releases huge, amount, huge amounts of heat. That heat is used to boil water into sh super hot... Oh my goodness! Super hot steam. Which causes a turbine to turn, which produces electricity. Underwater cables then conduct the electricity out to cities across the region. Can I, like, use the PC? I want to check out Kostra. Why won't you let me do it? Okay. We are going to end this episode here for today. So in the next one, I am going to go tackle the old nuclear power plant and see what secrets are hiding within and what Pokemons we might be able to catch. So if you guys liked the video, hit the like button down below and subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more of Pokemon Uranium in the future. And don't forget that the link to the game is down in the description and the full playlist will be down below me here on the screen if you guys have not seen anything up to this point or you want to rewatch and get caught up to where we are. So, that being said, this is Captain Tiger Lily and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye my little wolfies!